In this lesson, we are going to look at surface area. So, in an examination, you'll be required to calculate a surface area of a given solid shape. So, I will start by prisms. I start with a cuboid, which is also known as a rectangular prism. So, it will have uh, six sides, which means uh, these three sides are uh, colored uh, f I, uh, similar with similar sides like this uh, colored ones which are hidden which are opposite to this side so here we have a rectangle here we have a rectangle with the same size as this blue we also have a rectangle at the top which, is, which has the same size with the base then these sides opposite sides will be similar again so we have six sides or three pairs. So given that this three centimeters and this five centimeters and the length is nine centimeters, we are required to calculate uh, the surface area. So the surface area uh, is an area uh, that covers the shape, right around the shape. So in this case, since this face is three times five three times five here we also have a similar shape uh, which is opposite which is also three times five so here we just multiply by two which means we have two similar sides which measures three centimeters by five centimeters then we add another one here is nine here is nine times three nine times three here yeah. this side in green we also have an opposite side with the same dimensions we also have nine times five uh, uh, which is the top and the base it measures nine times five so we just multiply by two to show that we have two uh, sides with the same dimensions then we simplify here is 30 here is 54 here is 90 then we add, this will give us 174 square centimeters. Don't express in cubic uh, centimeters since this area, this surface area. Let me also demonstrate how to find surface area of a trapezoidal prism. So given that here the shortest side is 10 centimeters, then the longest side is 9 centimeters. And the slant height here is six centimeters, and the length is eleven centimeters. We want to find the surface area, so we have two uh, identical sides: this in green and this in purple. We also have a face uh, uh, that is a trapezium. At the back here, we also have the side with the same dimension which is opposite to this but the top and the base are different so in this case the surface area here we are given the height of five centimeters so we we'll multiply two times the trapezium area since we have two trapeziums then two side rectangles uh, side rectangles in purple here then we have the upper rectangle and the lower rectangle. So let me calculate here. Half times uh, 7 plus 9. The shortest and the longest 7 plus 9 times the height, which is 5 centimeters. We are calculating the area of the trapezium in green here. This will give us 40 square centimeters. But we have two in trapezium so we say 2 times 40 plus we have two similar sides in purple here which measures 6 centimeters which is the slant height here times 11 so it's 2 times 11 times 6 then we have the upper rectangle which measures 7 here times 11 then we have the lower which is the base 9 times 11 then we express in square centimeters, so this will be 388 square centimeters. Remember to use the calculator 
don't uh, use metal in exercise here with this cuboid I want you to find the surface area of this cuboid 8 centimeters, 6 centimeters, 6 centimeters here the height of a triangular, triangular prism is 5 centimeters and the length is 12 centimeters and the, the base here is uh, 8 centimeters then here the slender height here is 6,5 centimeters so find the uh, volume this marks the end of our lesson